everyone so right now i'm about to head to the gym i just changed right now so i'm wearing this black top and these black leggings both are from halara i'm currently gonna do leg workout right now and i have this cute little bag it's like my temporary gym bag at the moment whenever my brother and my sister-in-law came over they bought stuff and it was in this bag and they gave it to me it's a cute dfw cerveza bag and it just says modelo in the back I don't drink beer, but I thought it was a cute bag because I, do, I love um, beige bags like this. I'm waiting for Gymshark to restock on this mini black gym bag. They have it in pink and I think beige. I was going to get the beige one, but I feel like it's going to get dirty really fast just because I do set my bag on the floor at the gym. So it's this little mini one. I don't know if they restocked yet. As of right now, it's not restocked so i'm just waiting for them to restock the mini little gym bag and after the gym um i need to return one of alan's christmas gifts i got him two things from aloe as one of his christmas gifts and i have to return one of the items from them because it fit him a little too small and the other shirt i got him he loves it it fit him perfect and the color was like a really nice espresso brown color so so nice and i'm gonna go and Sweater. I was gonna keep it for myself, but I like my sweatshirts to be oversized and this sweatshirt fit Alan a little too small And it's this aloe Sweatshirt that everyone raves about so it's this black crew neck um, sweatshirt I have to return it the sleeves fit him a little short So yeah, I need to return this and I was gonna return it at North Park and exchange it for another shirt that I wanted to get him But it's out of stock. Of course. It's out of stock at the store. So I'm just gonna have to go um, drop this off at the post office or UPS. Oh, yeah, I need to go to Ulta. I need to buy a brush I threw away the one I had because I've had it for so many years and they do say to throw away your brush Because it's just really bad for your hair like you have to keep changing out your brush even though I did wash my brushes It's still recommended to like throw it out and get a new one. So since I had them for so long I need to get a new one. But yeah, let's go work out Heels. Is it? It is. Hey! I'm finding home from running some errands and guys, guess what? I totally forgot to go to Ulta. I'm just gonna go tomorrow morning for dinner today. I thought of making ground turkey chili. I haven't made that in a while, so it's one of my comfort meals. I really, really enjoy eating chili. And then I'm gonna make my own cornbread. I wanted to make kind of like a healthier version of cornbread, so I went and grabbed this Bob's Red Mill. Their oatmeal, their flour, I usually get from this brand. I got some chicken bread 
broth with 33% less sodium. And then I got some Rotel hot diced tomatoes. This one has habaneros in it, which is gonna be spicy. Well, I hope so. And then I got a mild one. And then to add some extra protein into our chili, I grabbed some low sodium kidney beans. I'm also really hungry, so I'm just snacking on my favorite pretzels ever. These are the Dots Honey Mustard. I love mustard. So good. I'm obsessed. There's hardly any in there, so I'm enjoying the last few pretzels. So I'm going to start with the cornbread first because I feel like it's going to take longer. I'm making the chilies pretty quick. I'm gonna be adding one serrano pepper to my cornbread. Once it's thickened up a bit, that's when you know it's ready. And this is the finished chili. I think it's a little spicy, but I prefer it that way. And it smells so good. I'm about to cut the cornbread. came out perfect it looks so good and it's soft you guys look at my presentation this looks so pretty i made this before chili but i haven't made it in a really long time when was the last time i made chili babe i don't remember chili yeah was it like last winter i feel like it was that long a year ago been a while mm. Mm, came out perfect. I'm gonna dip my bread. This is really good. I am gonna go ahead and enjoy my dinner. And then I have a package that I got earlier. I'll show it to you guys. I also have a lot of cornbread left over. But yeah, there's leftovers. I'm gonna be having this for lunch tomorrow because it tastes so good. Okay, we're finally gonna see what's in this package from Kiehl's. Um, please ignore my comforter. I just washed the sheets right now. And since I'm going to sleep pretty soon, I just left the computer messy like that. I didn't even know I was getting a package for January. I love Kiehl's products. Alan actually loves their um, moisturizer. If I have another one here because he just finished it, he loves it. That way I can give it to him. Ooh, what do we have here? I think I see the moisturizer. Introducing Ultra Facial Barrier Balm, the ultimate multitasker. I think this is one of their newest products because I've never seen this before. It's the Ultra Facial Barrier Balm. This bag's perfect for when you travel and then you want to put like your restroom stuff in here. Alan's gonna be so excited. Look, I have more of the moisturizer. He's gonna be so happy. Before I opened the package, I told him that I received a package from Kiehl's. He's like, did you get the moisturizer? And sure enough, I did. This is the Ultra Facial Cleanser. I've never tried this, so I'm excited to try this maybe tonight. And then we have Ultra Facial Advanced Repair Barrier Cream. This is the barrier cream. Okay. And then the last thing that's in this bag, ooh, how cute is this? You can literally put this on your keychain. This one is the, I believe this is the balm. Yeah, 
barrier balm it works as a multitasker you can add it on top of makeup for a dewy radiant look you can apply it under perfume for long lasting aroma and then tsa friendly for a mid-flight pick-me-up yeah that was everything that came in this Edge. what time is it? it is 9 41 i'm about to get in the shower i hope you guys enjoyed this video try my workout i just did today because it's my favorite i don't tend to change my workouts a lot i stick to the same routine at least for full three months and maybe after that i'll change it up a bit but stick to routine and you will notice results because if you have like all your workouts all over the place and you keep changing them like let's say every single week then you're not going to see progress and results so stick with your routine try it out and let me know what you guys think i'm gonna go ahead and shower i hope you all have an amazing night or day <laughs> i don't know when you're watching this but i will see you on the next one Bye guys.